Okay, this is exciting. I know you can just tell by the way I'm talking. <laughs> but this is, uh, check this shit out. No, I ain't hooked that up yet. I will later. <clears throat> All I did was I just flipped the board upside down on top of the screws. But we're going to call this zero right here. And I did. I dropped this down a little bit more right here because dealing with these limit switches, you only have so much room that you can go right here. So uh, that's where I'm at. Right there. All right. But I'm calling that zero. That way it can plunge from, well, right in here. <laughs> All right. You see, everything's ready. All this is, and this thing is, it'll, uh, it'll scream. I mean, it will. Uh, it's make, I know there's got to be a way to change the tune of the motors, the way they sound, because these two right back here are just like really high pitch. Other than that, everything else is super smooth. And I downloaded software, I got all that installed on the laptop, and there's process you gotta go through which somewhere I wrote it all down and well there's a website but just in case you ain't got a website kind of handy to have it shit you know I need a printer out there it is I need to print it out but look check this out <laughs> this is my spindle or my set on over here I right, will do it on full throttle right here and you can adjust it uh, right here I click that button. Yeah. I turn it on and off right there. Uh, and you can, I'll show you in just a second. You'll watch it. All right now I'm going to lower it. That's the RPMs. I mean, you can make this thing crawl. And I can do it right here as well. I can't hear it as much, but I can turn that thing down. This here tells me everything over here as well. And I need to study on this, how this hooks up to be able to work it. I got this going. Now, uh, when I do this little project right here, whatever this is, and I'm not gonna run it all the way through it. I just wanna show you something. All right, I'm gonna turn the spindle off. Now, let's say I done created a, this somewhere in something, and uh, one of the programs, and I sent the G code to it over here. And then I just take it and I just go send. I'm on, that's where I'm at right there. Can you see my little button? Send. I don't know how it re I'm pressing reset. Send. Wait a minute. I want that to be zero and that to be zero. I had to go through it all over again because it changed my values and I want my Z0 and my X and Y0. And then we're fixing to send it. I'm on the right button now. The spindle's cruising. Just barely make it. I mean, you make it all last. When it's running a program, I can't uh, turn it off. It's quiet though. That spindle is quiet. And with this one right here, it's not making as much noise. They were screaming earlier.
That is super smooth. Oh God, I can see something happening now. Yep, change this. Definitely gonna change this right here. Uh, all aluminum. And we're gonna make the little shields come up right here. Probably put a little dust, like that duster. It's a little felt lining. Uh, uh, boom, whatever you wanna call it. Ah, man, I mean, I mean, mm. well, there you go. And wait a minute, I came in and I crashed after I got this all set in here and in, in, in the house. I came in and crashed. <laughs> then I got up and started looking. So I really, well I get up four o'clock. I need to clean that. So four and it is, that clock's an hour off. It's actually quarter of nine, ten to nine. Go five hours. It took me to get this figured out and the software figured out. So, hot damn. There we go. Y'all enjoy. Peace. Nanny, nanny, shot pot, and all that other good shit. I can just see a router, a DeWalt sitting right here, cutting aluminum, cutting copper, cutting brass. <laughs> And working the hell over some wood. Face. Enjoy.